You have been wanting to create a NFT or NFT collection, but all you have is a phone and you don't want to pay for expensive software to create these NFTs. Then you clicked on the right video because today I'm going to show you how to create nice NFTs with just using a phone and it's super simple. So make sure to stick all the way to the end. If this video helps you out, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And without further ado, let's get right into this video. Okay, so as you guys can see, I'm on my phone here now. And this is an, and as you guys can see, this is an iPhone, but this works with Android too. So you just need a couple of other apps because not all of them are compatible with Android, I think, but something like OpenSea that is compatible with Android too. So, you know, it works too. Yeah, and you can just still follow it along. But yeah, as I said, we need these different apps or softwares. So we are just going to go to the App Store or Google Play Store, whatever it is for you. The first thing we need is Medibank Paint. So just search it up on here, Medibank Paint. And that is the app we are going to spend the most time on because that is basically our sketching app where we can get these nice little drawings down and create an NFT out of that afterwards. So just download that. Then we are going to search for another one and we need um, OpenSea, of course. So just search up OpenSea, OpenSea NFT marketplace and download that. Then the next thing we need is MetaMask, obviously, because we are going to log in with MetaMask on OpenSea. So just search that up and download that as well. But you know, you can use another wallet too, if you have another wallet that is not MetaMask. But of course, we just need a wallet we can log in on OpenSea with. Okay, and as you guys can see, Medibank Paint and OpenSea have already finished downloading and MetaMask is still loading, so that is fine. We'll just let that load. But now we can already get into Medibank Paint to start this whole thing. So open up your Medibank Paint app, or if you are an Android, then I will leave a link to a nice drawing app below, and then you will just get in there now. So we are just going to go in here then we don't want to watch a tutorial. So we are just going to say no. And we don't want the full version neither. So now we are in here. So we go on new canvas first. Not now new canvas. And then we just click on the first one up there. Here we can get our uh, proportions in. So I'm just going to say I'm going to create a 1000 by 1000 pixel NFT canvas now. And that is important because that is basically how our NFT is going to look uh, like how big it is afterwards. So I'm just going to say 1000 by 1000, you can obviously do something else. And yeah, that is right. So we are going to go on done. Now we are in here and have our canvas, as you guys can see. And here we can just straight get into the drawing part of our NFT. So first of all, we want to get a reference image. I'm just going to search up, for example, I'm just going to search teddy bear. I think that will be simple and nice to draw. So I'm just going to search that up and then we will get a nice image and add it to our photos. Now we can go back into our Medibank Paint app and add the layer. For that, we are just going to click on the tab right here and click on plus layer and then add a picture. Now, as you guys can see, I have my picture here. I can rotate it and scale it and we need to scale that stuff up just like that. That looks great. Okay, now we have our reference image in here, as you guys can see. Now we will go on our other layer. I'm just gonna drag it above and we can 
sketch from this. So basically here we got some tools, the pencil and the the pencil and the eraser obviously. And yeah, that's basically what we're going to need. So I'm just gonna sketch. Okay, so now we got our outer lines done. I am just going to say this is fine for now. Probably going to work on that. So now we want to get some colors in, obviously. And for that, we can just sl slide the bars over here to see some nice colors. That is a nice brown. And then I'm going to use the buckle tool right here to fill that in and something went wrong there so I'm just gonna use my pencil to close these lines up of course so now it should work so I'm just gonna grab that buckle tool again and fill it in boom just like that and just like that we have filled in our head too now I'm going to get another color maybe something like that and fill in the pause and this thingy right here now maybe we need an even lighter color for that yeah that works fine and then I'm just going to use that on that too just like that I've created some nice artwork already just with my phone and now I think I'm just going to fix things up and then I will see you guys back and show you guys how it looks. Okay guys, this is what I came up with after like 15 minutes or 10 minutes. Um, I fixed some things and I think it looks pretty good now. I think this looks good already, but we can even add some little bits to it by for example, taking a bit darker color. Now I'm going to take my pen. As if there is a little shadow just like that. And yeah, I think that looks great. Maybe we will add something more, something like this. And then we will just draw like a heart up here because like it's a little cute bear, just like that. And yeah, I think this looks great. Then we are basically ready to export our file. So for that, we are just going to go over here then we're going to go on export png jpeg file and here we want to choose the png one and here in the export tab we are just going to do down here on save picture or image and just like that we have created this nice nft drawing now we will turn it into an nft by going on OpenSea. So the app we have just downloaded here, we will just quickly go in and continue. Then we will connect with our MetaMask wallet and for nice for us that we already downloaded it. So we can basically, it's basically go, switching over to MetaMask now. So that is great. Just like that, get started. Here we then just create a new wallet, just get a password. Now we will move on to the secure your wallet tab. Just go on and say start. Confirm your password once again. So I'm just going to put in my password here, confirm that.
continue, go back. And now we will just have to put them in the right order. And just like that, we have created our MetaMask and here's our account. So now we will go back to OpenSea and click on the MetaMask link again and then click on collect, connect. So it's going to send us here and then we will basically be connected. We will go back to OpenSea again and now we should be logged in. Yes, we are. Great. So now what we want to do is create a new item. So I have just discovered that you can't really create an NFT with OpenSea app um, or I couldn't find the create button. So we will just go on here to our Google and search for OpenSea and try to do it online. Um, so yeah, just search up OpenSea. Just like that. Now we go back here. And now we can click on the create button. It's really taking some time loading. I don't know why it takes so much time. The good thing is we have already set up our MetaMask so we can just connect with our MetaMask here quickly and easy. So just click on the MetaMask thingy again. That will load. Then we will log in and connect it to OpenSea. And just like that, we are going to connect our wallet. So sign that and then the wallet should be connected. Now, as you guys can see, we are in here and can create our new item. So basically just go on, tap on this one here and we will upload our PNG that we just have created. And that's this one. So just take this one choose that and put it in there just like that. I'm just going to name this one cute bear just like that. Then you can add a link description. I'm just going to say something like that. Then here the collection section we can just um, go buy it because we are not creating a collection but a single item with this teddy bear. So just ignore that. Then supply one obviously. And blockchain we are going to use Polygon for it to be free to mint it on this blockchain. So yeah, once you have chosen all that, we are ready to click on the create button and then finally create the whole NFT. So just click create. Now we are waiting. And just like that, we have created cute bear, as you guys can see. And as you guys can see, that was so easy for me to create this NFT. So you can try this too with only a phone. And yeah, this was kind of an experiment for me because I've never tried to do this with a phone too. But as you guys can see, this works. So if you only have a phone, you can get into the NFTs too. So don't worry, make some NFTs. And if you have questions about something on this video, just hit me up in the comment section. Make sure to like and subscribe if you liked and enjoyed the video or if it helped you out. And with that said, I'm hopefully going to see you guys next week. Bye.